Thanks for tuning back in. I'm Tommy Campbell, still bald, still in my basement, and still fascinated by the bargain bin of right-wing crazies determined to paint President Joe Biden as a senile old man bumbling around his home and an international criminal mastermind at the same time. The Biden fell off his bike and forgot a name crowd wants him impeached and in a nursing home, and Marjorie Taylor Greene's been trying and failing to pull this off since 2021. And after being burnt so badly by Biden at the White House Correspondents' Dinner that she needed skin grafts for her Neanderthal head, she's been making the rounds with new claims of evidence that are laughable. But first, this. So they had 11 files at the cyber symposium that was given to the cyber guys. Now, this was just a snippet, everybody, of the 32 terabytes that Dennis Montgomery has from the 2020 election. First off, snidbit. Not a word. I'm guessing this is Lindell going for snippet. And again, Dennis Montgomery is a con artist, and you still believe he sold you the entire election. It is pouring MAGA tears. I lift the styrofoam lid on the nothing burger old spork feed is trying to serve. I mock the latest and stupid, drop a few surprises and more. Prince Charles became a king, you know, we've met. He's terrific, but I'm much closer with his younger brother, Andrew, since we used to holiday together at our close personal friend's top secret private island that we don't talk about, but it was terrific. This is really cool. Uh, my, my support uh, my support of, of Donald Trump is unwavering. I would take a bullet for the man, seriously. And a lot of us would, and we're going to, even if they wouldn't put him on the ballot, we'd write him in. Careful what you say there, dollar store Andrew Dice Clay. Trump would probably have you shot and use it as a promo in an ad to show the level of devotion his supporters have. Marjorie Trader Green continues to go after Biden, determined to impeach him, and never forget that she is part of the same crew that posted Emich Biden on their website. Yes, this is what we're dealing with. Here's MTG getting real about Biden's crimes with Dan Rather. Who's she talking to? Guilfoyle. You mean the defeated former president's son's makeup lab explosion survivor girlfriend in a Bon Jovi wig? Huh. But the true crimes are linked to Joe Biden himself. And he is the mastermind of the Biden criminal enterprise. This is an international operation that has guided and steered the policy of the United States of America to the point where we should have to ask the real question, are we involved in the Ukraine war because of the dirty secrets that Zelensky and Ukraine holds on Joe Biden and his family? All right, just because Trump has a P tape out there doesn't mean everyone does. Zelensky's dirty secrets that he holds on Biden? What were they playing? Spin the bottle at a sleepover and the gossip all got out? I guess Zelensky had some dirt on Australia, Cambodia, Croatia, the Czech Republic, Finland, and the other dozens of countries trying to help after Russia launched a full-scale invasion of Ukraine. Well, this is where we are finding true proof linking Joe Biden, uh, exchanging money to make real policy decisions uh, on behalf of the United States. It's pay to play. This is a true crime. And this was Joe Biden when he was vice president of the United States. The vice president does not make policy decisions. They're there to secede the presidency upon the death or resignation of a president. A vice president's only constitutional duty is to preside over the Senate. Vice presidents cannot vote in the Senate except to break a tie, nor may they formally address the Senate except with the senator's permission. Their appearances range from trips to show support for a nation, visiting troops abroad, to cheering on the team at the Women's World Cup in 2015. We are calling Christopher Ray, the director of the FBI, to come before the Oversight Committee and bring with him a form FD-1023. It's unclassified right now, but I bet you pretty soon it'll be classified. And that form shows the proof that Joe Biden took a money payment from a foreign national in exchange for policy decisions while he was vice president of the United States. This means that Joe Biden will be impeached and this is the evidence that we've under we have cut we have found out undercovered in only a few months a few months time we were able to do this sorry i'm just stuck on the fact that she said that she undercovered this undercovered wow according to a whistleblower the fd 1023 describes an alleged 
criminal scheme involving Biden and a foreign national relating to the exchange of money for policy decisions while he was vice president. Margarine Taco Gristle will keep saying this FD 1023 in every interview as often as possible, the same way Hannity continues to say FISA warrant. Well, I think my Don's got one right. Big sore. Anything they try to do just won't remove the clusters all down the middle. They're going to be heavily scarred. We were all delighted to see the amazing reception my father got in Scotland. People had complimentary signs saying he was a tangerine wank maggot. That's very UK. I don't know what it means, but it's probably really nice. <laughs> People are so awesome, man. Everyone loves the Trumps, okay? Especially the Scots. We should go more often. I'm super high. My Pillow CEO Mike Lindell continues to try and evade paying the cyber guy who proved him wrong. In that challenge, we said that you had to have CISSP credentials. Now, I've got, I'm just checking here. Um, this Zeldman or Zedman, whatever his name is. I Zeldman. This guy forces L's into words as often as Donald Trump forces himself into women. It's like having a. Um, I, I don't know, maybe it's like having a brain surgeon and a, uh, someone that's a, a nurse. I don't know. I don't know. But Zeldman did not even know how to open up the data. Trying to cash that five million Bob Zeldman check ain't going to be easy. People are not affecting climate change. You're going to tell me that back in the Ice Age, how much taxes did people pay and how many changes did governments make to melt the ice? The climate is going to continue to change. And there is no reason to just open up our borders and allow everyone in and continue to funnel over $50 billion or however many billions of dollars or trillions of dollars to foreign countries all over the world simply because they don't like the climate change. When I hear her talk about the ice age, it feels like when you eat an ice cream too fast. You know, like that brain freeze feeling. Marjorie Taylor Greene thinks homo sapiens are riding mastodons to their snow scrapers for meetings. You know, I should be shocked, but we're talking about the Jewish space lasers, peach tree dishes, and gazpacho woman here. Also, gotta say that when you Google Ice Age, this is the image that comes up. <laughs> like, it, it's her. I noted in this recent video how Ron DeSantis went full bobblehead and embarrassed himself and America abroad, and now even Newsmax has turned on him. This is like Tony Montana telling Don Jr. to just say no. ...and stuff where Biden got a hundred and some percent of the vote. Okay, well, that's impossible, everybody. You don't get a hundred and some percent. That's like that lady in Georgia last summer that got zero votes in her own precinct where her and her husband voted for, her, for themselves. The only reason I like Laura Loomer just a little is she reminds me I have to watch Labyrinth again. Very hoggle. Take the machines out of our country. You know what's left? Uh, trusting elections, and this country is 70-some percent red everywhere. So, um, Hey, we just lost Mike. All right, so, Laura, thanks for being with us. Folks, look for her on social media. Thank you again, Laura. Appreciate it. We'll get you back. Join Lindell has as much evidence of a stolen election as Marjorie Taylor Greene has of Biden's criminal dealings. Alex here, still in the bunker with Marjorie again. Good dude. The globalists, they don't want you to know, but the patriots are saying that Tucker Carlson could end up with a deep state busting conspiracy theory fake news show on the internet for steroid loving smooth brainers, and this would put him in a direct competition with me. Now, I'm all for this sort of thing, but if Tucker wants to go full Alex Jones, he's going to need to do a lot more than like flip on the camera and spew crazy stuff. But in preparation for our dark web battle, I've had a tanning bed delivered here, and I will be going commando and letting the pouch get some proper artificial rays so my tea bags are less uh, Earl Grey and more like a used coffee filter at Starbucks. And DG has been in it so much that her skin is reaching peak Dog the Bounty Hunter, Mickey Rourke, and the wrestler levels of leather. Okay? She has a hide. I'm totally cool with her sharing the electric ball bed with me, and I was sure to order a model that could handle the weight of two totally misshaped adults. Okay? 
It's a vet. But it cannot handle a single clogged pour from the pellet grill drumstick accident that looks like it was uh, half chewed by a street rat with Austin Powers teeth. <laughs> there are so many blisters and bumps on this thing. If you got a miniature astronaut toy, some fancy lighting, you could you could like fake a moon landing. That's how bad her skin is. But I would be advised keeping her seven mortadella meat stump reject turnip toes that look like they are trying to make a U-turn. I cannot figure out if they are trying to escape the bonsai mogwai or return to the beast base but i will never find out the real answer because what is the rule mtg the socks stay on the socks stay on well, probably the most difficult two weeks we've ever um, experienced in our life uh, in this in this industry why why um, is it the most difficult period of your life you know anheuser bush they held a social knife over all of our heads here and they dropped it very irresponsibly it, it threw us into turmoil by standing on our biblical faith. It put us at odds with other people that didn't, that, that didn't take that stance. And that brought us into hell on earth. A social knife, biblical faith. It's been the hardest two weeks of his life. It was a single can for one person, you whining, demented baby. If they had it their way, this version of their biblical faith would have us stoning people in arenas. Demented Joe with his sloppy files in his garage, and you are worried about the real president putting files that he declassified under lock and key? MAGA tears. This is the kind of loser that can't even change a tire. America, we need men we can trust with power tools, not crybaby liberals with their whiny woke BS. MAGA tears. There are so many sheep here, grass could grow on this pathetic channel. MAGA tears. Clown show for clowns, no thanks. MAGA tears. Thanks so much for watching. Help me out by joining us in the comments, sharing this video with a friend, and following me on social media. I am a one-man show here from script to screen, the editing, even the graphics. Please throw me a tip with the easy PayPal link or hit that super thanks button and be sure to check out my mugs that go great with those MAGA tears. I am a stand-up comedian, I've played in 35 countries, and I've toured with Jim Jeffries for nearly 10 years. I have three albums and a brand new EP from my opening set on Jim's latest Netflix special. You can stream these on Spotify, Apple Music, or catch them on SiriusXM. Thanks for helping me make this show possible. Life's short. Be cool. Be kind. Take care.